Hi all, this is just a quick video to give you some tips in a presentation window. So up here I've got a presentation window with different lists and I've added clips into it. Obviously I select my clip, press 3 to add it into the list or I can add from my matrix or my dashboard. When I'm working on clips what I want to do is double click and edit some information for them. So if I double click I open up the uh, register properties and this is where I can come in and add some notes, add some clip draw animations, etc, etc. Something else you can also do, rather than just having the name of this clip being shot own number six, which means that it was from the category row shot own and it was the sixth clip, I can change the name of this here. So um, let's say this was a high press, for example. And just to make things clearer for me here, I could change the color. So I select the color icon here, go choose a different color and I'm basically just changing things up there. Now let's skip to my second clip in this list. You'll see now that one says high press. I could do the same here, so let's say this is shape. We've got our notes and no drawings in this one. I come to my third one and say playing out from the back. Okay, and maybe I have, this is a red color because this is how I want to, to change things up. Okay, so this is just a, a quick visual thing, but a useful tool that we can have in that export is something called a presentation script. So that will give us a printout of what's about to come up in our presentation. This presentation script by default shows the first frame of your clip. So I would be looking at this here. But let's say I want to print out and want to see some specific parts. If I come to here, for example, and press this button here, which is my keyframe. I'm going to say set that as my keyframe for this clip. Okay, so I'm happy with that there. Let me just show you what that actually means. So if I click here on my presentation script and go notes and drawings, so I, I don't want the descriptors, I just want the notes and drawings. If I show this here, what it's going to do is show me the name of my presentation window, the name of that list that I've just created a script for, the number of clips inside it and the total clip length. Now what I have is the first clip and there's that color that I changed, the second clip, the third clip. This is the name of the clip, these are the notes inside of that clip and this is the length of duration of that clip. Because this one I'd added some drawings I can see a preview of those here. Second clip, the color, the name, the notes, the time. The third clip, the color, the name, the notes. But this part here, this keyframe, rather than it being the start of that clip, is that moment I specifically selected. So this presentation script, I would put it to PDF, then I can print that out and maybe hand it to my team. But just to show you there, what I wanted to set the keyframe, if I'm looking at a clip here, and rather than seeing the very start of it, I could come to this point, go to my keyframe button here, say that's my keyframe, and now that will be in my report. Okay, so presentation scripts are a really nice one to use and there's just some quick tips. Um, changing up the clip names just gives you some more context. Another quick way of changing the color, if I select a clip here and press C on my keyboard, think of color, I can now bring up this color tool and change it. Okay, if I wanted to change the color of the text that's here, so maybe it's quite hard for me at the minute to see that black on the red, if I click this register and press F, think of font, that changes it to white. If I click it again and press F, it changes it to black. So F changes it from white to black or black to white. C changes the color and we can also do that here on our lists. Choose the list, press C. And then if I can't see the text, choose the list, press F and it changes things up. So just a couple of tips there which should hopefully help you build some more detailed presentations.